This may look like separation, but it's actually solidarity. It's sacrifice and service to the greater good. It's a sign that, through isolation, we are fighting as one. And there's no better reason than that for hope. Hope is something we sports fans know all about. It's what keeps us cheering year after year for our favorite stars and our favorite teams alongside our friends and family. And in football, the draft is when hope starts all over again. the deep and passionate kind. Hope that the next pick will make this season the season. Hope that the next name called will be yours. But this year, we're hoping for more than a future star, a stronger line, or greater speed. We're hoping to fill a deeper need. With a future of full arenas, full voices, free reign, to gather, to feel the power of football together. Because that will mean life is back to normal for us all. So celebrate with these young men as they start their careers today. Looking forward to a stretch of glorious tomorrows. For this draft, we're not the Raider Nation or Cheeseheads. We're not red and gold or white and blue. We're one football family. Sharing our hope with all of you. That the voice of Peyton Manning talking about hope. That, of course, is Las Vegas, Nevada, where the draft was supposed to be held. But things have changed dramatically, and we have changed with it. The draft, in all its glory, is still coming to you tonight, just from a different location and in a different way. And with that, we welcome you in to the 2020 NFL Draft, presented by Lowe's. It is our privilege and delight to once again be with you here tonight. And we understand the world that we know has changed and may be changing for the foreseeable future, but we are still here to be a part of what is one of the great communal sports experiences of all time, the NFL Draft. And as we deal with the pandemic that is sweeping across this country, our thoughts and prayers go out to one of our own. Our own Todd McShay is not with us tonight because he's disclosed he is battling the coronavirus. Todd, we are with you. This draft coverage tonight is for you, and we look forward to getting you back and with us as soon as you possibly can. But we have it all covered like we do every year, people. You're looking at 60 remote setups of potential draftees across the landscape. We will have those reactions as we always do, the raw emotion when they come. We also have all 32 teams. We've got them ready to make the picks. You will hear for all of them, and we've got our team as well to break down every single pick. But ladies and gentlemen, let us get this party started with the commissioner. Welcome to the 2020 NFL Draft, and thank you for taking the time to be with us. Like millions of fans, team person.